Man. I can't believe I got fired from Joe's Crab Shack. Now I will work at Sam's Club. Welcome to Sam's Club. How can I help you? Me and my girlfriend will like to get rolls of toilet paper please. Because we have no more toilet paper at home. We would like to buy some more air freshener too. I'm sorry, but we took our toilet paper off our shelves due to the increased cases of the virus. And we have no more air freshener please. And also, we are all out of both items. No way! I can see the toilet paper on one of the shelf and you did make a good point and I can see the air freshener over there. So can I still get both of those items? Please! Listen, we do not have any more toilet paper because of what's going on in the world. And we do not have any more air freshener at the moment. So try looking for it at another store. Fine. I will just to to Lowe's. You are very rude. I hope I never see you again. If you do, I will tell your boss to fire you. Welcome to Sam's Club. How can I help you? Me and my girlfriend would like to get a 45-inch Samsung Smart TV, please. I'm sorry, but do not have that TV on stock right now. Don't lie to us. I can see one of the employees making it in the electronic section. Besides, I can see one of the customers getting one of those TVs. So can we please get one? Listen, I had arguments with so many jobs in the past about us not having smart televisions, and this job will not be one of them, so please get out of here already, not rude. Fine. We'll just go look for a TV target instead. You're very rude. And I recognize you from one of my latest jobs. So don't deny it. Because I will tell Electromatic. Welcome to Sam's Club. How can I help you? I heard on the news that movie theaters are starting to reopen everywhere. So I would like to get the Skittles variety box and the Hershey's one for my girlfriend Serena please. I'm sorry. But we have no more variety candy boxes on our shelves right now. And we took some candy off our shelves. Don't lie to me. I can see one of the candy on the shelf. Also. The variety boxes are on the shelves because the store manager told me earlier. So can I still get it please? Listen. We do not have any more variety candy boxes right now. And I do not want to argue with anyone about candy. So you're going to have to go to another store instead. Sorry. Fine. I will just go to Walmart or Dollar Tree to find myself packets of candy there. I hope I never see you again and I know you were the same guy that I saw at your last job. Welcome to Sam's Club. How can I help you? I would like to get some garbage bags from my house please. Because I have no more garbage bags in my house. I'm sorry, but we are all out of garbage bags here. Don't lie to me. I can see plenty of garbage bags in one of the aisles on the shelves. And I already know you guys have plenty of garbage bags here. Do not lie to me like that. Listen, we do not have any garbage bags on our shelves right now. So you're going to have to go to another store if you want to buy any garbage bags to your house. Sorry man. Fine. I will just go to another place to go look for garbage bags. I do not talk to customers who lie to me. If I ever see you again, I will call a rudest vendor on you. Bad joke. Welcome to Sam's Club. How can I help you? Wait a minute. Weren't you the same guy that worked at Joe's Crab Shack? Which was your very last job? Because you look very familiar. Number. That was Cyan Animator is a Canderson Animations version of me. Sounds like a lie. I'm serious, both of those Borises look very familiar, and they might have covered for me to work at Joe's Crab Shack instead of me just so I wouldn't fire it in the first place. Boris, I'm telling you right now, I am not one of those users that should mess with. I know you lied to those other customers about this, but I'm not one of them. I'm telling you right now. You are not one of those people that you should mess with. I know you are lying, so I'm going to tell you what is going to happen. And this is very serious. Again, you can tell the truth. We can call this a day. And I can tell your boss to fire you. Or, if you lie to me, there will be two options to get out of this. One, I will beat eat you up. And take you to, to jail. And you will not be released. Two, your boss will fire you. And you will not be at to work at any retail store ever again. You wouldn't. Also, 
You're not going to beat me up because I do not want this video to get demonetized because the video where I was beaten by Vanessa was demonetized, and I will choose to. But that still doesn't prove anything. Yes I was rude to the customers, but I was not the same employee, and if I was the same employee. Sorry, wrong answer. You should not have lied to me. You were the same employee. As a matter of fact, I just checked the security camera, so you cannot deny it Boris. You can't. I will not beat eat you up now because I do not the creator of this video to get in trouble, even though I'm very good friends with her. And I should respect that, but. So instead, you will be exposed for lying to me. I will tell my crew on you and you will be in a lot of trouble. And I will be telling your boss to fire you. Do not move, if you move. There will be serious consequences, so do not move until your boss tells you to leave, and I will see you later. I can't believe you Boris. I just can't. Boris. How dare you be rude to the customers and lie to Taylor Delacour. Also known Crystal Inkling 28. Don't deny it, because she told me. That's it, you're fired. You are also banned from Sam's Club forever. I will also suspend your Sam's Club membership for lying to three customers as well. Now go home right now before I call the cops.